Y'all saw that goofy man, uh, original chain snatching fella. He ran up on me in Miami, baby. Man, this is crazy. Yeah, y'all don't even know, well, though. Yeah, what, what, what happened with that video that I seen? Man, that, that ain't even the whole video, because I was finna kill him. And he one of, and he one of his closest motherfuckers I think he was. I took it. He was at the door. Listen to how the video come on. The door come on. Ding, ding. You hear a beat. And he get to talking right away. Gang, I'm all the way on the other side of the store. With him at the counter. With switchy on me. My dead grandma, my Glock 22, burgundy button, I mean, burnt pink button on this bitch, on Lil Brown, boy. Burnt pink trigger on this bitch. On Scrap. On my dead sister, on Jakarta Barnes, boy. His ass for the die in that stuff, boy. I don't play that like that, boy. I was being cool, gang. Look, I'm already in Miami, gang, right? I'm with five strippers and me. I am, cuz. I was down about myself, right? G Glock on me, right? I lost my gun and everything out there. Then I blood. You feel me? Cause this the nigga who, you know what I mean? He booked my fighting shit back, you know what I'm saying? My cousin shit, cause I had to go kind of do some interviews and shit. I had to come back and finish some songs and shit. You know, I had some shit going on, man. I had to come back and intend to. You know, he was my manager and shit at the time, you know what I'm saying? But we for the, you know what I'm saying? We bringing this shit back together, man. Rich Lifestyle, FBG North, man. You know what I'm saying? I ain't taking FBG off shit. Oh, folks great. But yeah, though, that nigga ran up on me, though, gang. It was fed to die in real life. Cause at first I was trying to handle myself. You know, I tried to handle myself like a gentleman because I was with all females, you feel me? And for the most part, I've been with them for like a week and they've been seeing nothing but me being a player. You know what I'm saying? I've been, you know, they've been seeing me smooth. They ain't been seeing me tweaking or doing no, no goofy shit. They just know like, damn, he got a switch on him. You feel me? Shorty got a blick on him. You feel me? They know I got this bitch on me on my dead sister. Nigga. I left the rack, went to motherfucking. Without the gun though, cause I had nothing on me. Hold on, wait. But yeah, I left the rack and motherfucker went to Philly and left Philly and went to uh, Jersey and then I went to DC and then I went to uh, Miami on my homie night. So I was with all females though throughout this whole travel game. So you know, I try to handle myself like a gentleman in front of them. He butter, what's up, a little J? Cause I, my first instinct was to tweak, over tweak on them, you know? And, uh, I looked at the females and shit, and I'm like, man, shit, what the fuck you think he had? He in jail, cool. You know, I said what I said, brother, 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 right? You know, he said what he said. But then when he said what he said, he caught me off guard because I wasn't expecting him to say that, gang. I took, I don't, I, I was some real shit, gang. You don't know me. You don't even know what type of time and I'm on, gang. You don't even know what type of time and what my headspace said, gang. So in real life, I don't be expecting certain niggas to talk certain shit out there. Then when they do, I react a certain type of way. But it's completely up to you how you want this reaction to be, though, um, bro. But yeah, though, man, you know, when he said this shit, I had to catch myself off and kill him. That's why I asked him, hey, you want to die? Shorty on two? You want to die? Because his finger was over the camera. But if you if, if his finger went over the camera, y'all would have saw nigga. I had a whole pipe to him. You want to die in here, shorty? The white people, they, they in that bitch, they, everybody freeze up to, on the side, um, bro, the gang. And I wasn't in Walgreens. They said I was in Walgreens. No, I was in the store next door to Walgreens. I was in the liquor store. Getting my little mama on, bitch. Um, bro, but yeah, though, I really felt like I handled myself accordingly because a lot of people want to see me crash out, gang. They want to see me catch a case, gang. They want to see me throw myself away. They want to see me jack the look. My little career before it even start. This is what a motherfucker is expecting. You feel me? And I'm doing the unexpected because I ain't do what y'all thought I was gonna do. I ain't even do what I what I wanted to do. You feel me? Because I understand my my purpose here, and I understand my success level right now. You know what I'm saying? Every t every app I get on. Soon as people see my face, they butter, 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 butter. Shout out to my bingo family, man. Y'all know, man, I be on bingo, man. I be on that bitch's boxer shorty. You hear me? Book bag, real FBG butter, blood sign, man. That's how y'all find me, man. Tune in, gang. I be on that bitch acting crazy. Y'all know y'all can't smoke, show no guns. No, you know what I'm saying? Keep the kids off camera because they kicking you out that bitch. Um, bro, but yeah, though. Hey, no, nah, though. But so, yeah, though, man, you know what I'm saying? I understand my success level at this point. So I can't jag myself. 
You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna handle this shit correctly, man. Because I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna achieve the goal that I'm chasing, bro. And you know what I'm saying? I'm not only chasing it for me, bro. I'm chasing this shit for my kids. I'm chasing this for my brothers, my homies. Like, you know what I'm saying? I do this shit. It's not just for this purpose of, of, <clears throat> of me. I do this, this the, the purpose of me doing this shit is so I can open doors that maybe my homie couldn't, couldn't open. You know what I'm saying? And make sure my other homie can get through that door. Because if my, if my other homie can get through that door, guess what? He might get through another door that I couldn't get in. But if he in that door, guess what? I'm in that door too, gang. Ready to find that bitch every day. As long as he do, all you gotta do is open that bitch up for me. Like my homie Darion the Don, gang. Shout out to my homie Darion. Folks rap a lot. He doing his thing, folks, right? It's a door that I ain't in. Folks done. And guess what? We just we we been collabing. Some of my some 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 of my hottest shit, gang, from Victoria to Turn Me Down. I got a lot of little shit that people ain't even on to. I recorded with gang that I made with gang, right? You know what I'm saying? And his platform, what he at right now, the people that he connected to, they bigger than what I got going on, right? But folks, guess what? Folks right here. He come, he come free. He... With your boy, folks. He showing me the same love I'm showing him, gang. And we both, you feel me? We both up here. We go, we at this shit. We both running up. We both running to this shit like this, gang. You feel me? But it's look, it, it, it hit different when you get that type of love from other people, other artists, both for over other doors for you. That shit be dope as hell. What's up? This is Cam Capone. We got more content like this coming soon. So hit that like button, subscribe, and stay locked in to Cam Capone News.